They call it an extremely large screen. And in this video, let's unbox it. This was sent to me by Gigabyte. You couldn't guess by the title. And this is a 28, 38, 58? I don't know. It's a really big screen. And I'm trying to think about how to really show this off to you. And I just thought, let's unbox it. And I'm just going to give my impressions of the build quality. And then we'll jump into, you know, kind of some of the color gamut range. And Atlanta. I've never unboxed something this big. It's so big, I keep kicking my light. Oh my gosh. Okay. One box down. One to go. Timber! Goodness gracious. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Woo, dolly. All right, so we have our stand, if I'm not mistaken. Some parts, cords, mm, tons of different cables. Oh, for all your different countries. Gotcha. So this is some other country, some other country, America. Okay. Let's go ahead and pull this bad boy out of here. This is our stand, and uh, here's our monitor. Sweet action. Okay. Oh my gosh. There it is. Wow. That's a big display. Sorry, Mike. Gigabyte. Okay, I'm gonna try and get this out of here without knocking too much stuff over. There we go. Woo! All right. So here it is. This is the M28U gaming monitor from Gigabyte. And that is a beauty. A little on the heavy side, not gonna lie. But I mean, it's fantastic. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and just get this thing set up and talk about it. So far, um, build quality looks solid. I'm gonna try and unwrap this stuff as neatly as possible. But build quality looks solid. Feels a little heavy, but then again, it's not a laptop. I'm not carrying it around. But it's funny how when you get used to reviewing laptops, how much weight and like size and everything like starts to matter so much. It's like everything you talk about. How does this weigh? How big is it? What does it do? Um, but the build quality looks good. The build quality looks really good. You got a nice power button. You got your switches there. You got a lot of connectivity. So it looks like you can connect uh, two HDMI's, a Display Port, a Type C, um, a USB 2.5 is that? It's like that weird square one. Three USB uh, Type A 3.0s. So there's a lot of connectivity here on this screen. Um, now let's go ahead and uh, see if we can get this thing set up real quick. I'm excited to test out the color gamut range, which I will put up here in just a second. So after this video comes out, I will actually have run the tests and everything. Um, so the color gamut range I'm anticipating is going to be pretty good. Um, maybe not amazing because this is a gaming monitor, but I'm hoping that even though this is a gaming monitor, they still give us really good color gamut range. I love the setup this thing. This thing is so easy. You basically just, this is a twisty, so you just stick this on here. I do need no tools to set this up. This is incredible. All right, so then this goes on there, and then these just clip right in, right? So I'm going to go ahead and clip this in here like so. There we go. Bam, I'm literally done. You've you've quite literally watched me set up this entire this entire setup. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this plugged in. So there's the screen. It is it's a it's a hefty screen. It is a very big screen. I'm gonna actually be doing a full desk setup. I'm gonna redesign my desk for like the ultimate video editing setup. So go ahead and subscribe, keep an eye on the channel for that. As you can see, the color gamut range coming up on the screen right now. This is a 144 hertz 4K flicker free display. Now this is fantastic for 4K video editing as well as your gaming interests if you're somebody who likes to game on the side of your video edits. Now for me, that flicker free is gonna be a big deal. I spent a lot of time looking at these monitors and I felt a little bit of eye strain lately. I'm not sure if that's due to my current monitor or if it's just I've been spending way too much time working 
2019. Uh, either way, I am not quite sure, but this lot, this, but this screen looks so crisp and I'm super excited to get it into my full desk setup and set up my ultimate video editing setup, which I've been waiting to do for quite a long time. And so when this monitor came in, it was like, now is the time. So links if you're ready to make a purchase, likes if this video has brought you some value and subs if you don't miss out on that video coming out here in the future. See you in the next one.